Oh, welcome now. Today we discuss on the forage chopping handling equipment. You know the forage harvesters, uh, the generally uh, to cut the harvest uh, fodder crops, and the fell type forage harvester use a free swinging chains, hammers or knives to sever the fodder plants by beating or cutting action. Simple fell type forage harvester can be mounted behind the tractor or offset types of fell type forage harvester are preferred as they avoid the problem associated with the one set of tractor wheel running through the crop before it is cut. Now this is the fell type of forage harvester fitted, fitted with the adjustable twin chop shear plate. We can see the uh, a rotating knife and it cut the grass and throw that grass fodder crop. Now the forage harvester with pick up pair feed uh, rollers and uh, wide contracting uh, contra rotating cylinder. You can see the different parts of the cutting rotor, field roller. <coughs> laser bar top roller you can see the way of the grass coming in and the passing through the uh, top and pick up reel and then again uh, it provides the laser bar to cut the grass and chopping the grass and the cutting rotor is throw the grass to the outside this is the another view of the now this is the tractor operated fell type of forage harvester come chopper. This is the another diagram of the uh, forage harvester then loader. And this is the self uh, propelled fodder harvester cutter bar type in operation. Now the fill choppers are employed in a several major methods of the harvesting of forage including the following. Uh, harvesting corn for silage it includes the delayed harvesting for low moisture silage then direct cutting of hay for green feeding as an uh, alternate to pasturing or in uh, making a dehydrated alpha alpha meal or pallets then direct cutting of hay for grass legumes silage it contains the near about 7 to 80 percent moisture then chopping from the window for winter grass, legume and silage is really 65 to 70 percent moisture. Then chopping from window for low moisture grass, legume, silage sometimes known as the haulage and it contains the 40 to 60 percent moisture. <clears throat> Dry chopping from the window for storage as a hay artificial drying needle if the chopped at uh, much above the 20 percent moisture the cheap objective in chopping material to be stored as a cure hay is to reduce the material to length that can be handled by an impeller blower and moved in a pipe along with an a stream and with silage the additional important function of chopping are to facilitate the packing for exclusion of air and to make a feeding easier. Fell type field chopper, all the field chopper, uh, forage choppers were of the precision cut shear bar type employing either flywheel or cylinder cutter heads. The direct throw field chopper has a taper discharge spout that cover the full width of cut and direct the material from the rotor into the forage wagon utilizing the kinetic energy imparted by the nodes on the rotor. Then cupped knives of the type are employed to provide the impelling action operating at a high peripheral speed 46 to 56 meter per second. And this type of knife pumps as a considerable amount of air which contributes to high power requirement. An average shredder length may be in the order of 65 to 90 millimeter. Shear bar type field chopper the basic component and general characteristics. Shear bar type field choppers are 
available as either pull type or self propel machine because of the general availability of the large tractors practically all pull type models currently manufacture have a pto drive an advertised capacity of 54 to 73 milligram per hour now pto uh, per hectare advertised capacity is 54 to 76 milligram per hectare per hour sorry pto power requirement uh, for the maximum capacity uh, larger choppers are 75 and uh, over the 100 hp in general share power type field choppers including the following basic functional component are gathering unit to cut the standing plant or to pick up the windrowed material <coughs> or a conveying uh, and feed mechanism with spring loaded rolls or apron to compress and hold the material for chopping and uh, cutter head or chopping unit another conveying or impeling the arrangement to deposit the chopped material in the transport vehicle you can see in a diagram you see the uh, two common types of mechanism top shear bar would be horizontal for plywood cutter head feed mechanism to common arrangement for feed mechanism are shown dramatically a chain and slat apron with notch angle iron crossbar sometimes replace the two upper rollers plywood type cutter head uh, the cylinder type cutter head showing the optional recutter screen and the edge recutter screen would normally be about the level with the cylinder the cylinder type cutter head with coupled knives and direct through the moderated curved knives or essentially for flat knives the chopping length uh, theoretical length of cut is defined as the amount of advance of feed mechanism between the cuts of successive knives and theoretical length is adjusted by uh, changing the speed of the feed mechanism or the numbers of knives on cutter head and third possible uh, variable the cutter head speed is usually not adjustable on present day field chopper and currently production model provides the instrument to obtain the maximum theoretical length uh, of 3 to 6 mm and maximum setting range from 25 mm to 90 mm and uh, six knife cutter head can be operated two three or six equally spaced knives from two to six feed mechanism speed are provided by means of the gear shift box and sprocket changes forage wagon the typical shape on uh, unloading forage wagon has a chain and slat conveyor on the bed that moves the material to the conveyor located across the front of the wagon. Chain and slat cross uh, conveyors are the most common type but augers and belts are sometimes employed. And vertically uh, stacked group 2 to 3 tooths, rotating beta shields of the advancing load informally onto the cross conveyor. When the cross conveyor deliver the material into the hopper of the elevator or conveyor at the storage site <clears throat> the forage blowers uh, are popular for handling the chop metal because of their simplicity depending dependability and high capacity basically a forage blower consists of feed hopper and conveyor that feed the material into the impeller blower similar to the unit on the some field choppers Impeller blower depend the primarily upon the throwing the action blades rather than upon the air velocity. The impeller blower has a relatively small number of blades, usually 3 to 4 on a field and 6 on a forage blower. And the housing is a concentric with the radial clearance between the blades and the housing properly usually not over 3 mm. This is the forage blower. With typically short hopper, most units do not uh, have the adjustable control size uh, feed opening. You can see the schematic diagram or arrangement of the impeller board. Thank you very much.